Hey guys, it's Beantown Reviews coming at you again with another video. Uh, today we are en route right now to one of the greatest restaurants in the history of mankind. Um, brings back a lot of childhood memories when I go to this place. Um, Bonanza. Bonanza Steakhouse. Are you kidding? No. So in its peak of popularity, there were 600 Bonanza Steakhouses in the country. Now, there's only eight left. Yes, eight, as in less than 10, uh, left in the whole country. And they're kind of sprinkled and hidden through the country. Um, so I was actually in Maine on some other business and I was not planning on doing this video, but I'm going about 20 minutes out of my way to attend and visit and eat at Bonanza Steakhouse. Remember grabbing your tray when you walk through the door? Um, I remember this as a kid very, very vividly. You grab your tray, almost like a lunch line. You put the tray down on the little counter and slide it down the counter. You go to the potato station first. You get your mac and cheese, your corn on the cob, dunked in a big bucket of butter. And finally, you meet the grill guy and get your steak, your choice steak. Um, they've got T-bones. They've got sirloin steak. They've got ribeyes. We'll probably get a ribeye today, I think. The biggest one they got. Bring us back to the memories. But hey, 600 in the peak of popularity in 1989, and now there's only eight left. One of them is here in Sanford, Maine. Let's go check it out, guys. Guys, we are en route right now to Bonanza Steakhouse here in Sanford, Maine. Look at this. This is like bat country. This is like God's country here. Look at this. This is like back roads and you know, big open fields and mountains in the distance there. But hey, we will go, Bean Town Reviews will spare no expense to visit the coveted Bonanza Steakhouse. We're almost there, guys. We are about, I'd say, five minutes away. So let's check it out. Okay, guys, here it is. Bonanza Steakhouse. Look at it. Just looks just like it used to when I was seven years old coming here all the time. There it is. Look at that. Welcome to Bonanza Steakhouse. Let's go in. Okay guys, we're gonna go in to Bonanza Steakhouse. Something to point out, it is only about 4.55 p.m. right now, and this place is packed. This place has lots of cars in it for so early. I'm surprised, but let's go take a look. This is literally the same it used to be with the trays and everything. I can't believe it. They haven't changed it one bit since like the late 80s. This is incredible. It looks completely the same. They give you the trays, slide it down the counter. Amazing. I'm not gonna videotape the uh, cash register lady. She looks a little um, like no sense of humor. So we'll uh, order the food and then uh, we'll turn the video back on. All right guys, we just ordered uh, the food here. I'll give you the ticket like they used to do. Got myself the ribeye with baked potato. I'm gonna get myself uh, a drink here as well. I'm gonna move it all the way down and pay. There's a shot of the steak options, a close-up shot of the steak options here. All right, what are we gonna drink? Let's see, I don't know. They've got the same cups that they used to have too, though I think they used to be yellow, but they're still that same textured plastic material. Can't believe it. Everything is the same. How about some Tropicana? Tropicana lemonade, I think that'll do. Here we go. 
the coveted steak knife. All right, let's go. Here we go, I'm pushing the tray. All right, let's grab her. Let's, let's pay, I'm gonna pay. There's the grill. Covered the grill. All right, guys, we just sat down. How this works is um, just like it used to work in the olden days. Um, so they give you um, a plate, but the plate that they give you is not for your main entree. It's just for your salad bar plate. Um, so you sit down at the table and they give you a number. Um, so for example, my number is number 18 and there's my plate and there's my lemonade. So while my food's cooking, I'm gonna go up and grab some salad bar items. Um, the trimmings, so the sour cream for your baked potato will be up on the salad bar, you get a salad, and then they bring you your steak. So for the steak, for the uh, 10 ounce ribeye steak, the baked potato and the salad bar and the drink, was twenty dollars and twenty cents. A little bit more expensive than uh, what it used to be back in 1989, but hey, who's complaining? I am in the same exact state. They haven't changed the layout of this at all. Um, all the bonanzas used to look like this. I had been to a couple before, and this is insane that they kept it the same. Um, even the register when I went to go check out was like this old like 1980s DOS computer she was pushing the buttons on. This literally is surviving in the same capacity that it has been. Um, since like the late 1980s. So let's go get some salad. Okay hey guys, time for the salad. Number 18. Take a look. The old school steak knives that they used to have as well. Some pepper here. Wow, it comes up fast. A little bit of salt. And the steakhouse steak sauce. And then the steakhouse steak sauce covered it. Let's try this out. Now you don't come to a steakhouse for the salad, I might add. But it's still fresh. Fresh lettuce, it's not soggy. It's cold, it's not dry, it's not warm. It's good. So far, so good. Just, um, just like the memory. Very good. Cheers. <sighs> Can't wait for the steak to come. Second to the last one, buddy. We'll switch this back on when the steak comes. I'm gonna enjoy my salad. But you can see the steak core is classic 1980s with the wood on the floor. And drop ceilings. Unreal though. It's it's completely the same. 
And there is the Bonanza House steak sauce. It used to look like that as well. Our specialty blended premium steak sauce adds sweet, tangy, distinctive taste to any steak. I'm doing okay on my salad. All right, guys, the salad has been conquered. Bring on the ribeye. All right, guys, the food has arrived. It is here. My 10 ounce ribeye, my baked potato with butter and sour cream, and my carrots are now here. Let's take a peek. It is heavenly. There you go, guys. Baked potato, carrots, 10 ounce ribeye, and my lemonade, and the salad. It looks pretty remarkable, just like I remembered it. Uh, except uh, when I used to come as a kid, they used to put your plate, your food on a plate that had like wood handles and the center part of the plate was like cast iron. It's just a regular plate, but we're gonna check it out and see how good this is. I'm anxious to slice this open and use some steak sauce on it. Bon appetit to me. Time to chow. Do you like it? Now, when I ordered this, they didn't, they surprisingly didn't ask how I wanted the steak cooked, so I got it a nice medium. I think that's the default. Huh. So good. It has that nice, like, flame broiled grill to it. Phenomenal. It's just like I remember. Mm. Mm. Thank you. There's only one steak in the world that tastes like a Bonanza Steakhouse steak, and it is insane. I've never had, I've never had a steak taste like this. I've had a lot of great steaks. Now. I wasn't planning on making this video, so I apologize for the uh, makeshift tripod that I had to make out of a ketchup bottle. I don't have my tripod with me. So good! So good! I'm gonna enjoy some more of this and I'll be back. Not this exact restaurant where I am now, um, but this chain, and it hasn't changed. I mean, there's little tiny little changes, but for the most part, 95% of this place is exactly the same. Um, it's just amazing how, you know, a restaurant can go from 600 establishments in the United States down to eight. Eight left. I'm at one out of the eight left in the whole entire world. Amazing. Uh, eight left in the United States. Not many, not many. Um, I'm surprised. I'm surprised it didn't stay popular. Um, but it's certain, certainly popular here. The parking lot is packed, and I got here at like 4.50 in the afternoon. Uh, and it's starting to fill up now. It's starting to fill up now. It's a Friday evening uh, right now, so probably gonna get a little bit more busy. But hey, my food didn't stand much of a chance. <coughs> no steak left on my plate. All right, guys. Um, We'll uh, see you when we get outside, but um, I can't believe maybe a little bit more tour before we uh, 
before we leave because uh, I don't really want to leave. This is like bringing back so many uh, great childhood memories right now. But hey, let's do a little bit more of a tour before we take off. And guys, I forgot about dessert. So every meal at Bonanza Steakhouse comes with a coveted soft serve ice cream. Just a little crock here. Let's see if I can do this without making too much of a mess. All right, just wanted to try it. A little bit of a uh, sauce here. Let's see if I can do this. Do it all the same frame. There we go. A little bit of sauce. And some toppings, maybe. Sprinkles. Good deal. All right, guys, it's time to leave Bonanza Steakhouse. <clears throat> Just like I remembered as a kid. Amazing. Simply amazing. Even the same red bench that they always used to have. Incredible. Guys, I mean that if that doesn't take you if that doesn't take you back, I mean that is I mean that is all 1980s, retro 1980s inside that restaurant. And it hasn't changed. It hasn't changed. Take a peek of us. Bonanza Steakhouse, there it is. But hey. All right, guys, we are done at Bonanza Steakhouse. That was incredible. Um, you know, if you're looking for a little bit of nostalgic throwback, I rate this a 10 out of 10 for sure. Because anybody that, remem that remembers this chain and goes to any one of these one out of the eight left in the whole entire country, We'll be taken back. I mean, like I said, even the cash register the girl used to ring me out and, and to take my order, it was like an old 1980s DOS computer. They have not updated or dumped in any money into this place. And I love it. I dig it. I love how they've left it alone. The, the very few that, are, that have survived, they are crushing it. This place is packed. And uh, I understand why. For 20 bucks, a 10 ounce steak, a salad bar, um, a drink, and an ice cream sundae. 20 bucks! I mean, come on! I think it used to be like 10 bucks when I was a kid, but hey, still, that is incredible. Um, so hey, several thumbs up to, uh, to Bonanza Steakhouse here in Sanford, Maine. And uh, you know what, guys? Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel, Beantown Reviews. We'll see you next time, guys. Peace.